News 19's Wake Up for Wishes Telethon, sponsored by Window World. Well, if you're feeling generous, today is the day for you. Phone lines have been open for about two and a half hours now for our Wake Up for Wishes Telethon. Yeah, it benefits Make-A-Wish Alabama, and the dollars you donate stay right here in the state, helping our children's wishes get granted. News 19's Lauren Layton is live with the operators of the telethon right now. Lauren, are the phones ringing? How's, how's it going? The phones are ringing. You can see we have a couple people on calls right now, ready to take your donations, but look at how many free hands we have just waiting for you right now. You can see that number on your screen. You can call that and you'll answer to any one of these people, including, whoa, whoa, who's out of uniform there? Carmen Fuentes. He's got his blue tie on, though, and he is ready to take your calls. Go ahead. And, I'm not hearing the ringing, guys. I'm not hearing it. But we've got multiple ways to donate. So we've got donations online. We've got them through our website, all sorts of ways. Let's go ahead and see how far we are into our goal. How many people have donated this morning? We've gotten $17,395. That is incredible, you all. We are just shy of granting a second wish there. An average wish is about $10,000. So we've got a hefty goal if we're going to grant the six that we're trying to get to this morning. But we are so, so grateful to everyone who has donated so far. And of course, all of this goes towards children right here in North Alabama who are waiting for their wishes to be granted. And let's take a look back at Malin Kate. She wished for a puppy and a school gym full of students. Let her know her wish had been granted. And then out came One, Penny. Two, three. Look at that, that is Malin, Kate, and Penny, and you can see her mom, Megan, there, and then obviously the Jeep. The Jeep went all through the halls of James Clements, and you can see those girls there. They were really impacted because this is such a special moment, you all. So let's go ahead and talk to Malin, Kate, and her mom, Megan, right now. And who do you have with you down there, Penny. Malin? Penny. Penny. Oh, look at how well behaved she is. She doesn't like the camera too much. She doesn't want to be star of the show, but that's why you're our star, Malin, Kate. So so Megan, let's talk about how you pulled the pulled the trick on Malin here when you uh, took her to James Clemens. We did. We surprised her and we told her that her brother was getting an award at James Clemens. So we took her there under the guise she was, that he was getting an award and surprised she got a puppy. That's wonderful. And what did you think when you saw Penny, who was so tiny then, run up to you? <gasps> did you know that you were going to get to ride in the Jeep after that? That you were no. going to get to show her off? No. No. And she's so much bigger now. How many years has it been? Two years? Three. Three years. Three years. So what have you been up to since then? Been cuddling. Brushing. <laughs> <Play>. Brushing. <laughs> Playing. Playing. Lots of cuddling. And she is so soft, so the brushing is paying off. And what kind of dog is Penny? Mini Golden Doodle. A mini Golden Doodle. Oh, she, sorry, Andrew. <laughs> the cameraman, she does not like okay. you. She but let's see, it. what kind of tricks does she know? She knows how to sit. Oh, what a good girl. I've been girl. trying to make her lay down with a toy bone, but it doesn't really work that much. Well, she's got a, a mind bit. of her own. That's what matters. So you guys are very involved with Make-A-Wish. So once that wish was granted, you didn't just say, thank you, bye. You are still very much in it. What kind of things Absolutely. do you guys do? We've gotten to do a lot of really fun things. We've gotten to go to a lot of sporting events and, and, galas. Um, and that's yeah we've gotten to do some galas and then um, we go every year before the Trailblazer Challenge and we get to put signs in yards of the people hiking and always like knock on their door and get a chance to say thank you for all that they do for Make-A-Wish. That's incredible and why is it so important that you all stay involved? Um, organization is amazing. They gave May her very best friend and they were so supportive to us and they loved us so much and they continue to support us and to love us through everything that she's going to go through in the future. So it's really important to us to be able to share how amazing Make-A-Wish is. Wow, and we are so grateful that you come back to us year after year. We had you here last year and then you're back with Penny. I mean, yeah. highlight of the morning is usually Malin, Kate, and Penny and Megan. We absolutely love Thank having you. you guys here. And if you at home want to get involved, help grant wishes just like Malin, Kate, you have the power to do that. Let's go ahead and take a look at the screens now. You can, of course, call 256-319-1371, or you can scan that QR code on your screen right now with that black and white box there. Of course, texting. We love texting. We're in a modern age, digital age. Text the word WISHES to 243-725. Again, that is 243-725. We are so grateful to everyone who's donated so far. So far, and uh-oh, we might have a... We might, Karma Fuentes is on a call, y'all. 
And we're not going to eavesdrop. We don't want to put pressure on him. I see his hand shaking as he's busy at work there. No, I'm just kidding. But we are so grateful for all of our wonderful operators. They've been doing a phenomenal job this morning. And just to give you guys a heads up, this is the last time you will see us on the CW. But guess what? We're going back to WHNT for 9 o'clock. So join us there. You will not want to miss what we have for you. I promise. I can't tell you anything more, but you just got to trust me on this one. Thank you, guys.